The Facebook app for Windows Phone 7 was updated today to version 1.1, which includes places and photo tagging now. So we'll give you a demo of how the new app works. First thing you'll notice is it's actually a lot faster. And it's not as jerky when you'd scroll. And it's actually decently fluid. It's still nothing like actual Windows Phone itself. So it still is definitely jerky here. But it definitely loads a lot faster than before. So you can look through all of your stuff here and you can look at events and your notifications here and they made the notification text bigger and it all works pretty well that's all the same stuff as before but then if you go into your photos here you can now tag photos so you can tag photos here by just clicking tag photo and then you can drag that little box around something put a check mark on it and then tag a name and you can also make things your profile picture or delete them if they're your own pictures and stuff like that but the new feature is tagging there and there's also Facebook places which was added and that's accessible right here and when you open up Facebook places it'll ask you to agree to their terms and conditions and you can look at where your friends were at what time like beyond Brad here and then you can go ahead and get a map of that And then I'll just open up Bing Maps here with the GPS coordinates right there. And so you can look at where your friends were there and then you can go back to the application. And it actually resumes pretty well there now. You can also look at other things like you can look at comments on them and all the other stuff that you can do from the web browser and you can also check into places yourself like you can search a nearby place so you can create a new place then if you want to with your location and you can call that location like your home So then when you get home, you can just click home, and then you can click check in. And you can also tag some other friends that are with you if they've opted into the tagging system. And you can check in at that location. You can see who's here right now, if any other friends are there. And... Yeah. So that's Facebook Places in the new Facebook app. Another thing they updated is the ability to run the Facebook app under your locked screen. So you should be able to turn off your screen now and it's still there instead of having to resume every time. That's pretty good because this app does take a while to load. Overall the Facebook update is pretty nice. It definitely did make the app a bit faster. Hopefully another update will improve that some more because it definitely does have some lag there, especially scrolling through your news feed. But it's looking pretty good. You should be getting your Facebook update in the marketplace anytime today.